Good morning. Uh, welcome to <clears throat> the first video of this series that I'm going to try to make this year uh, as I start training for the full Ironman uh, for 2024. It's currently December 30th, 2023. And I wanted to end this year on a high note and start the year on one as well. So I'm going to start the 4x4x48 four by four by challenge today. <clears throat> what that is, that's four miles every four hours uh, for 48 hours. Uh, so that's, that's two days to run 48 miles. Uh, so you run four miles every four hours until you hit that full two-day 48-hour mark. Uh, this was... Um, a challenge that David Goggins incorporated. Uh, if you don't know who that is, just look him up. Uh, I recommend his first book, Can't Hurt Me. Um, just watch some YouTube videos of him as well. So <clears throat> I've done a 50 miler. I did that in 2022. It took me 12 hours, 19 minutes. So I'm hoping this challenge is easier uh, than running 50 miles straight um, with two days. Hopefully that gives my body enough recovery time in between uh, every four hours. The biggest challenge is probably going to be the sleep deprivation, uh, which my wife and I have an eight-month-old girl, so our sleep has been average at best. <laughs> so hopefully this is something that I can tolerate and something I can complete. So with that, with that being said, let's get into it. Done. Four miles done. Uh, pace 8.51. Feel good. Run number two, a little over eight miles in, 8.57 pace. Feel pretty good. Run number three, 12 miles in, still around 8.57 pace. Took Remy on this one. Feeling pretty good still. Sixteen miles in, pace is slowed down a little bit. Uh, starting to get a little tired. Twenty miles in, that was run number five, pace nine oh seven really starting to feel the fatigue now going back to bed twenty four miles we are halfway in gonna go back to bed the night back up on the downhill side of all these miles so the fatigue the sleep deprivation is not good right now but gotta keep pushing 
a little over four hours in, 28 miles done. Two miles in, pace is coming around the same average, it's starting to snow, freezing cold. A little over five and a half hours, 36 miles. I am so over this. Tough parts of these challenges is that you truly are alone most of the time. There's no one else out here. No one's gonna choose to go on a run in sleet and snow when it's below 30 degrees out. It's just me and my thoughts. A little over six hours. We just hit 40. 915 pace, two more left. Forty-four miles in. One more lap to go. Currently 47 miles into this 4x4x48 four by four by challenge. I've given 100 percent I'm completely empty. Nothing else to give. I've been focusing on my favorite quote on this last segment, which goes as a body should be treated more rigorously. Seneca, the philosopher wrote that it may not be disobedient to the mind. How can you expect yourself to step out of your comfort zone when the stakes are high if you aren't regularly doing so when the stakes are low? We must test ourselves daily. We must remind ourselves who's actually in charge. You, not the pull to be comfortable. You, not the desire for everyone to like you. And you, not the need to sound smart and all knowing. Seven hours, 23 minutes, one second, 48 miles challenge completed completely exhausted don't have much to say other than that was one of the hardest challenges I've ever had to do sleep deprivation alone finding time to eat and just the constant pending doom of you know you have four miles coming up even though you just finished four until you finish at 48, <clears throat> 48 hours later. Happy New Year, it's officially 2024. This was a good challenge to end 2023 on and start 2024 with.